Hey, what's going on fam? Welcome to the FOMO channel. I am Mr. FOMO himself. Um, today we're going to be talking about a lot of things. <laughs> so what I wanted to talk about today was all these high yield, high ROI depths. For example, this one. And this one. <laughs> and the list continues on and on and on. Now, as you know, I've been jumping onto this RI dApps for quite a long time now. I've actually, it's some I've made money and some I've lost money. Uh, you've seen me go through the ups and downs of these apps altogether. Now today, the reason I wanted to do this app is because first and foremost, let's go into this one here called FTM Stake. Now, I, I jumped into this one here and I put in 100 FTM uh, Phantom and that was on the 26th of March. In five days, this will mature. Now, the next question is, they've got 951,000. It's going down 100,000 a day. I've noticed it. Now the question is, will my money survive to see that actual... I, I don't think it'll happen, so I'm probably going to lose 100 Phantom. But if it did happen, that'd be fantastic. But if it doesn't, so be it. That's the way the cookie crumbles in the most of the things. So I've been doing a lot of these ROI dApps, right? So I get a lot of... I did this one here, Avex Pool. Um, I covered this. What else did I cover? Let's just go Many Staker. God, let's just jump into. I think I think Many Staker is still running for me, right? Um, let's just jump into that one there. Pulling on and going to Belly Staker. This one here was a little bit smarter. I think I just took the I took the the easy way out. I guess instead of putting the iron balls to the test, I decided you know what I'm going to take profit of this one. So let's just have a look at it. So you can see my Matic there. If you go down, you can see I've got 100 Matic. And I can withdraw out 23 Matic at the moment. Um, so yeah, so a lot of people, from what I've noticed in my videos, as you can see by the referrals as well, uh, a lot of people aren't really jumping into these ones like they used to. They're a lot more cautious now. They, they understand how these work. But there's a whole bunch of people out there who actually don't understand how this works. Now, I'm not in the name of... Uh, I'm not in the name of shaming and gaming people, but in this case, I do have to. Um, I feel, I feel, um, I mean, sure, okay. So this is where it comes in. I can only give you guys the information. You guys have to spend the time to get to know the information and also understand it. And then you have to do your own research, you know. Please understand, I'm not a financial advisor here, guys. I'm not here to give you financial advice. So take the time to research what you're getting into. And, you know, um, there's some, there's a comment, oh, the comments disappear. There's this amazing comment, yeah, that that Mr. Foba can't believe he's shilling this project. You know, goodbye, I'm going to unsubscribe. Now, there's, there's good ways to have conversations and bad ways to have conversations, right? There's childish ways to have conversations and there's adult ways to have conversation. An adult conversation would be, hey, Mr. Fobo, you know, like, I see you, you're shilling this one. Okay, let me research that a bit more. But however, don't shill those because it's not a nice project. No, so on, so on. But to say that I'm going to ascribe and threaten somebody is really not on, yeah? If, if you're part of this channel, you're part of this community, you're allowed to have a say, but it shows to me your level of competence and your level of maturity when you're willing, are you one of those guys that just because someone doesn't talk to you for a day or two, you send them 50 messages and then you then you block them? <laughs> you know, that is such childish behavior. I, I don't appreciate childish behavior at all, you know. Like, we're on this together. Like, I've taken quite a few for the team. I think I've taken more than a few for the team. Um, and I, I, think, I think it comes down to the fact that I'm willing to have conversations with people if people are willing to understand it. So, what are these ROI depths? What are these depths themselves? Now, I haven't taken profit yet out of this one here. Uh, what's the contract balance? I actually don't even know what the contract balance is. Haven't ever had a look. Um, let's check on the contract balance. Just whilst we're here, there's 500,000 in there. So we're, we're, we're good for the moment. We're good. But will I break even in this one? I doubt it. I might get 50 Medicare out, I think. So I'm, I'm starting, I think I'll, in the long term, I'll be looking to get away from these kind of plays because I find them just not worthy. And even if you're coming in early, like I'm finding it tough to make money on them. Um, 
I make some money from referrals, but I don't want to make money from other people's money if they don't make money as well, because that's just not good. That's just not good for anybody, is that? Um, to understand these RI depths, you must be early first and foremost. Secondly, these are Ponzinomics for sure. These are hundred percent Ponzinomics. If you don't understand by now, that by now, you shouldn't be in this. Now, I am waiting for someone to jump into one of these and create something with a better contract value and in a way to protect the investors, yeah? Um, there must be a way. There, there has to be a way, but someone hasn't come up with it yet. Um, I've been thinking of ways as well myself, but obviously, you know, I don't have the money or the power. Because to do these, you need a lot of money. You need you need a big marketing fund as well, you know, because that's what makes these tick. Because most of the people jumping into this come from YouTube, fair, fair, fair and square, yeah? So we just need to understand what we're getting into. And right, right now at the moment, I think... Where are we at is we just don't understand what we're getting into, some of us, but most of us are, but some of us are still not understanding what we're getting into. So please, please, please take the time to understand what you're getting into. These are all Ponzinomics. Um, I don't want anyone to lose their money in these kind of things. I definitely don't want anyone to lose their money on my account that I'm held responsible, you know. Look, but again, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just showing you my journey. Um, like this one here, I don't think I'll get my money back. There's a hundred in there. I don't think I'll get it back. Um, and the other one, the FTM stake, I don't think, I was stupid enough to leave it for a long time. Yeah, I don't think I'm getting it back. And um, the other one, I don't think, the X, uh, the X, AVEX one, I don't think I'll get my money back as well. Um, so please understand that I do take losses and they're constant as well, you know. But in, otherwise, I do make money as well. Um, like, like BNB has been fantastic. Cash Cow has been fantastic for me. Um, Sometimes it also takes a bit of patience to wait for things to happen as well, guys. You know, we're, we're in this together, so we should all try and understand it a bit better as well. Now, if you guys have any questions, please put that down in the comment section. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, please spend some time just to hit that sub button, you guys. We are on a journey at the moment 2000. Um, hit the notification bell, and don't forget to hit like, comment, and all the other jazz as well. I, I have a massive giveaway planned for 2000, so let's just get there, guys, together as a community. And guys, let's be more as a community. Like, I would really appreciate it if we're a bit more positive, you know. Look, I'm going to make mistakes. It's just the way things are, you know. But there's ways to talk about it, so let's try and talk about it like adults, you know. Um, if you want to be treated like an adult, then talk like an adult. Simple and easy, yeah? So anyway, that's all from me today, guys. It's a really short video regarding how I feel about ROI depths. I'm trying to get away from them, but... You know, they do they do pay the bread and butter at the moment. It's, it's all I can get, you know. Um, I think when I get to 5, 3K or maybe 5K, then the real jobs will start, you know, and that's where the real money is. Um, and getting more for the community that we can all help each other out. Um, there's something really exciting coming out of this week as well. I'm really excited by it. Um, so hold on to your crow, your, your crow bangs, guys. Uh, there's some exciting news coming. That's all for me today, guys. Hope you guys are having an exciting Monday. Peace.